I would like to demonstrate how to do the steering oar on a pulling boat. So the first thing that you do is you unlash the oars. Unlashing the oars! Unlashing the oars! And then you take out the steering oar, which is the one that has that orange tip. Lashing the oars! Lashing, Lashing the, the oars! oars. And then you are going to grab a monkey line and this monkey line is going to help us set the steering oar on the aft cleat and we're going to go ahead and do that. So we're going to bring the steering oar back here. We're going to grab the monkey line and undo the gasket coil and we're going to go ahead and do a clove hitch. Well actually I'm going to do two ways, actually I'm going to do the the cloak each way first. So you go, you leave about um, two feet from the tip of the oar and you do a cloak hitch here. And the way that I like to finish it is I just do a slip hitch. I mean, a, um, one barrel knot here or one um, turn of a uh, two half hitch. So just one hitch. And then you bring it down here and then you will proceed to go around here and then around the oar and then back to the cleat like this and then around the oar again and then doing a figure eight form here and then around the oar again oops and then i like to go around twice and then I finish by cleaning and locking it. So that's the first way of doing your steering oar. And this basically what it is, is instead of being a tiller, it's more like a, you're rowing. So you are rowing with this to help you steer the boat. Since we are right now at a dock, you're not gonna be able to see it, but this is basically the principle of it. Excellent, that is. Steering oar 101. Okay, I'm gonna show you another way. And then I'm gonna let you practice. The first way that I show you, for me, it's the better way it's more secure but this way um, it could be done faster so I do a bowline I put that bowline loop through here then I bring the oar whatever I want it and then I start going around in an emergency or if I need to do this really fast and then I'll go around like this so it's basically like a uh, Boy Scout lashing, actually. Lashing, and then yep. now you're frapping. Exactly, exactly. And then same thing, I will finish up by locking it here. This, it's a faster way of doing it, um, if you need to, but I think that it's not gonna be as sturdy as the first one. So, it's up to you, whatever you need to do in order to get that steering oar in the water as soon as possible. Excellent, that's it. Yay.